We wanted to go over this really quickly. If you wanted to make an anemometer at home with your kiddos, maybe you can't make it out here. It is just some simple ingredients. And I talked to Madeline earlier. Hey, what do you think an anemometer measures? One more time. Wind. Wind. She is so smart. Okay, Miss Desiree, tell me what are some of the uh, ingredients that we need to make this at home? Absolutely. So what we're going to need is a pencil. This is our stick. We're going to use four straws and four solo cups. Uh, then what we're going to do, as Tavian's doing over here, he's taking some tape and he is wrapping two straws up. Um, and once we do that with both sets, you're doing great, Tavian. Roll that up like a little snake around it. Absolutely perfect. I'm and not good at crafts, you guys. <laughs> at Madeline's because hers is already done. Sorry, Tavian. Look at that and watch. Watch, let's hold it down here. Oh, 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 we didn't put the pin down far enough, but you get the point. We gotta put the pin down far enough. But once it does that, what do you think it's gonna do? Is it gonna spin? We should probably stick to doing weather on the green screen. We're gonna show you the final product coming up in just a little bit, but isn't that cool? So neat. Okay, we're gonna set things to break and we're gonna have much more coming up in just a little bit.